Yeah, the flooding has subsided significantly tonight, but earlier this evening, the rain was coming down hard. The streets were flooding and the creeks we're filling over and we've got some videos to show you that were sent in to us from different parts of the Austin area. We'll start with the video from Fox 7 Austin's Libby from around 430 this afternoon. This is on North Lamar Boulevard near Shoal Creek. You can see many vehicles driving slowly through those flooded roads. Now this next video was sent in from Will Stewart at around five o'clock this afternoon. It shows Bolden Creek at South First. He says it was bone dry this morning and and rose very quickly, similar to Shoal Creek. Now here's a video of Shoal Creek shot from the tallest building in the city. This was sent in by Brian Rawson at around 5.30. You can see the creek is moving, flowing fast. You can also see those cars moving slow in traffic. A reminder to take your time driving in this weather. It can be hard to see the car in front of you and the roads are slick. And here's one more video of a creek. This is Waller Creek between 45th and 46th Street, sent in at around 4.30 from Kyle Florence. It's at one point this evening, Waller Creek was spilled over and the area was closed. It has subsided for now. Now, the last video is from viewer Alex Wild. This is at around 4.30 in West Austin at Lake Austin Boulevard and Exposition Boulevard. Again, vehicles in flooded waters, windshield wipers flying, cars splashing water onto other cars. And I spoke with a man who was in the area later and says the water rose even higher than this, up to about three feet. He says his car sucked in water, died. He had to jump out and push his car out of the way so it didn't get stuck. It went from like one foot deep to about three feet deep, 30 seconds. Uh, so it, it splashed and, uh, and I tried to pull up into the middle lane to, to get out of the, the depth and it sucked water right up into my intake. So at that point, uh, I knew that I, I needed to push. The National Weather Service has measured 3.6 inches of rain at Camp Mabry, making today the rainiest day of the year so far. And a flood watch is still in effect for the Austin metro area and Hill Country counties until Wednesday. So definitely be weather aware and remember, turn around, don't drown. Reporting live in downtown Austin, Meredith Aldis, Fox 7 Austin News.